Transitive and intransitive verbs. A transitive verb has an object, a word that tells who or what receives the action. The intransitive verbs tell why, where, when, and how. Let's look at these three sentences. The boy kicked the ball, it went into the gutter, he cried. First, let's identify the verbs. Kicked is the first verb. Went is the second verb. And cried is the third verb. Now, if you can answer who or what, then the verb is transitive. With kicked, does it tell the boy kicked who or the boy kicked what? Yes, so the boy kicked the ball. That tells what the boy kicked. Therefore, kicked is transitive. It went into the gutter. Does this sentence tell went who or went what? No, it tells went where. And therefore, it's intransitive. He cried. Does that tell who or what? It does not. Therefore, it is also intransitive. Now let's try something different. Let's talk about pronouns and antecedents. A pronoun takes the place of a noun. The noun that the pronoun takes the place of, that the pronoun refers to, is called the antecedent. So let's circle the pronouns. There are two in these three sentences. Correct. It and he. Now, let's find the antecedent. Draw an arrow to the antecedent. What does the pronoun it refer to? What went into the gutter? The ball. That's correct. The boy kicked the ball. The ball went into the gutter. It refers to the ball. He cried. What does he refer to? That's correct. He refers to the boy.